I'm really excited to tell you about the news that we have with Araco. Araco is a global wood and plywood manufacturer with large clients like IKEA. What we're announcing today is a pre-order of 100 AI-powered autonomous forklifts. We believe these forklifts are going to help them achieve a safer, more sustainable work environment. I'm Nicholas Lyota, and I'm the Director of Hardware Engineering at Syngin. My name is Sean Stetson. And I'm the VP of Engineering here at Syngin. Araco brought us in because they were looking for a company to help them automate the material movement through their facility. So imagine a facility uh, where you have stacks of uh, wood products, uh, plywood and other composite ma wood materials that are eight feet wide um, and stacked as much as 30 feet tall. The first 80 or so percent is automated by a couple people. The last uh, part of their operation is extremely manual. So this is a high uh, throughput facility with lots of different places where materials being moved and a lot of people doing that movement across the facility. Every day, the forklift operators have to get on and off the forklift hundreds of times to unbundle and rebundle these, these pallets. And by making that autonomous, the operators can focus on the things that the humans need to do, and the robots can do the jobs that are tedious and repeatable. One of the things that we're very focused on the development of this forklift is safety. We use AI-enabled model-based detection to keep everybody within the Rocco facility safe. Our vehicle is equipped with a set of sensors that allows it to know when it is safe to drop, safe to pick, and really just clear to perform the operations that it's been directed to do. Another thing that I'm really excited about is seeing the efficiency throughputs that we're going to gain by having these forklifts deployed in the field. When a new forklift operator is hired at, at Araco, they go through a week's, a week's worth of training. At the end of that week, they have to perform the forklift test. The forklift test consists of a pallet stack that is stacked up six pallets high, and then that stack needs to be unstacked and restacked uh, in another place within their facility in less than 15 minutes. Singes Autonomous Forklift was easily able to pass this test. Now that we've passed that test, Singes is optimizing the algorithms of the Autonomous Forklift to make sure that Singes Autonomous Forklift is the most efficient and safe within the Araco fleet. One of the benefits of an Autonomous Forklift is that it drives in a more controlled way in terms of accelerations and decelerations. And that ends up using less power and less electricity over time, which really helps uh, with our customer sustainability efforts. The manufacturing industry is facing a lot of challenges. The main ones are labor shortages and safety issues, which we're seeing across the entire sector. Every year in the U.S., there are 50,000 forklift-related injuries. Uh, there are millions of jobs that are currently unfilled. This can lead to a lot of downstream issues, like uh, not just limited productivity, but also operating this heavy equipment and doing these potentially dangerous operations can really th lead to safety issues as well. The robots don't take breaks, they don't call in sick, and they're always available. One of the things that makes Sinjin's approach unique is we're not tied to a single forklift size operator manufacturer. We can scale our technology and our sensor kit to a wide range of applications, all within the material handling space. The thing that makes me excited about what we're doing with Araco and the forklift that we're developing is that it's doing things that I haven't seen done before. 